What is up, Batman vs. Superman fans? I'm Tommy from ZD Comics, and welcome to my Batman v Superman Dawn of Justice official teaser trailer breakdown. Yeah, I will be breaking down scene by scene the official Dawn of Justice trailer. Uh, this is my first time, not my first time watching it, but my first time really going by scene by scene. If you want a more in-depth analysis on Easter eggs, I'll be doing an Easter egg video later. But if you're just looking for a scene by scene and want to know what's going on, well, here you go. Let's get started. Is it really surprising that the most powerful man in the world should be a figure of controversy. Okay, right there, looks like there is a man. My guess, this is at a talk show host or on the news, and the guy is basically speaking to the world. Is it surprising that Superman is the center of all this controversy? No, it's it's not surprising at all. We okay, so right here, this is Metropolis. Okay, now I can almost guarantee this is Metropolis. You can see in the left corner, there is a crane hovering over a building. Not much else you can tell from the buildings. Like I said, maybe if you zoom in really in depth, you can find the LexCorp building. But as of right now, just from looking at it, you can't see much. It's definitely dark. There, of course, is clouds. The sun sort of piercing out. But as the trailer goes on, lights in the center figure right now, that is a statue. Lights appear above and around that statue slowly as the trailer progresses and you'll see that soon also the right building the one that looks like there is a diamond covering it that looks awesome i don't know what that building is i don't know really i can't tell about its like structure but it looks awesome as a population on this planet have been looking for a savior, savior. yes basically right now they're talking about superman they're saying we've been looking for a savior they're basically religiously they're saying we've been looking for a savior second coming of christ oh my god it's superman Right off the bat, you can tell this costume is brighter. I see yellow or some sort of gold in the center console of the logo. Uh, Superman, he just looks, oh, he's like, god damn, like I'm scared. These people right now are reaching out to Superman. They want to touch him. People are like, oh my god. Like they, like they don't even want to say like, oh, we hate Superman because he's so powerful. They're scared of him. There looks like there's a group of people with Max, uh, not Max, paint on themselves. They look, uh, I think there's a name for them, but they have the black eyes and everything like that. Basically look like they could be in a carnival. Maybe there's some sort of gang. Right now they just look like some messed up city street gang people. We're talking about a being Alien. whose very existence... They are not as you might have heard there, they said being, and then all of a sudden you hear the word alien. This is another scene of the building. You can see that lights are appearing, and the shadow where like the cloud is in the back, where I was talking about that building, light is piercing through slowly, but light is coming into this scene that we kept on getting. And yes, someone did say most powerful human, and whisperingly you hear alien. Telling us the truth. The challenges are there. There he goes. Another light. Our own sense of priority. Our own sense of priority. Okay, you know, they're, everyone's rethinking their priorities. Holy shit, there is a person that can literally lift up the entire world. What should I think about doing a day? In the universe. Okay, so that could be reminiscent to the very first Action Comics trailer where we see Superman in a similar stance holding a car. Could be very similar to that. This is a rocket. Looks like there was some sort of explosion. This is great. I love the Superman costume. It looks way bigger, really, really big, and it's bright. It really is bright. As dark as this trailer is, Superman's costume still looks bright. And this is uh, really nothing on the trailer right here. Um, the rocket, it says Pocket Uma, I think. P-O-C-K-O-O-M-O. -O -O -O. Um, then the rocket number is like 300. Not much I can tell from there. Human beings have a horrible track record of Tragedy. following people of great. Okay, there we go again. You can see more light in the background, and slowly light is piercing up around that statue. Power corrupts, and absolute power corrupts absolutely. Chaos. Okay, this is the most interesting part. Superman going down to some sort of bunker, and these soldiers are kneeling to him. Maybe he's just a... Okay, what? Why? Why would Superman tell soldiers to, like, what? What's going on? If I was Superman, or if the Superman in the comics, soldiers were bowing to him, he'd be like, yo, yo, guys, stand up. It's all good. I'm just one of you guys. I mean, he's not, but still, come on. Guy trying to do the right thing. better now, don't we? 
More light. Devils don't come from hell beneath us. Devils don't come from hell beneath us. They're warrior. No, they come from the sky. Oh God, this is the world has been. Look, Superman uh, uh, fly, flying in the sky. Some man is reaching out to him. That's all. We, we really don't know. So caught up with what he can do that no one has asked what he should do. Go on, go on, go on. God, I, I feel like they're saying kill him. I keep on listening to it over and over again. I still cannot find out. If you know what they're saying in this part of the trailer, please leave it in the description box down below. False God. This is like the best scene ever. You see Superman. This, this is a statue of Superman, if you haven't noticed by now. That was this. Apparently, they did make a statue of Superman. I think we saw this like before. And somebody put false God. Wow, that's... That's deep right there. That is really deep. False God. Because people are treating him like a god. That's how it starts. Now, this could be Alfred. I'm guessing this could be Alfred. I have no idea, though. Or Batman. Love that piercing. This is like Batman's side of the trailer. The fever. The rain. Oh, God. Yeah, he looks like Bruce Wayne. He looks exactly like Bruce Wayne. Right there is Ben Affleck as Batman. And he looks like Bruce Wayne. A lot of bees. If you don't mind for a second, I'm going to yell at my dog. Buddy, shut up! I will not cut that out because, eh, I like my dog. Anyway, that's Ben Affleck as Batman. Oh, God. Um, love, oh, God, I can't. Look at that face. It's, ooh. Now, he could be in the Batcave right now. I, I looked at this trailer a thousand times. I can't find anything. Uh, maybe I was like... This is a teaser, guys. Is, they're just teasing us here. There really is not a lot of Easter eggs in this trailer. But I will search for The them. feeling of powerlessness. The feeling of powerlessness. Okay, another shot of the Batman. This is we saw this in the teaser teaser. This looks great. It looks it looks awesome. Uh, you're gonna get a better picture real soon. The turns, good man. This is probably in the Batcave, by the way. Cruel. That is the logo, you know, just an animation. 2016. Right here, okay, I don't want to spoil too much. That's obviously Batman right there. My guess is, really have no clue where. There's spray paint everywhere. Right off the bat, Riddler Easter egg, Joker Easter egg, many other. Hold on, right here you can see, again, graffiti everywhere. If you look at more in depth, you could find things like the Joe. Joe's written twice. Joker. Joker, hint, immediately, done. Question mark, Riddler, hint. I might see the word Grodd, I don't know, but if you examine this for a while, you'll notice a lot of villain Easter eggs. Okay, so this is a helicopter, some sort of AC-130, a military plane, landing on the Bay Harbor crate, crate section. Don't know what could be going on here. That is... looks like a plane shooting at a truck. The man shooting, it doesn't look like we can really identify him, but that is a nice truck right there. And that warehouse looks like the warehouse where the Batman and the Bat, uh, what is it? Well, I think we got a picture of the Batmobile. That looks, could be the warehouse where they took that picture. That is the Batmobile. Oh, it looks so awesome. Oh, oh God, I am, God, that looks great. More animation of the logo. Oh. Oh my god, I just, I, excuse me for a second, I just caned my pants. That looks sweet, he looks so buff! Oh, he looks so freaking big! Oh, he looks, oh, that's the best thing I ever, that's the best, I look so, ah! Oh, yes! Oh, that's exactly what I want to see, that is Batman right there! Oh, logo. Oh. Yeah, Batman is standing upon... What looks like a skyscraper. Oh, this is the first look of the armored suit. Must be most people have been asking. You're gonna see in a second. He has a deep, that rasty voice, most likely from the suit. This suit's pretty sweet. I feel like during a fight, the part covering his mouth will shade down to block any heat vision by Superman. This looks great. Maybe we can get more in depth on the suit. We'll find out what it's made of. Maybe it's from like the mascara. The eyes are lighting up. It looks awesome. This is basically what we Tell me. Do you bleed? Tell me. Do you bleed? 
there is a back shot of the suit and that is Superman with the bright costume while it's raining it looks like they're about to fight hence the name Batman v Superman you will. right people have been saying right there it sounds weird it sounds really really dark I like it actually I, I first didn't like it but now I do it's just, if it's like the voice that Batman's going to have throughout the whole movie, then I will most likely hate the movie. It's the voice he has at this exact scene in this teaser trailer. I'm perfectly fine with it. That's the whole trailer for you guys. I want to hear your thoughts in the comment section down below. What did you think of my breakdown? If you want to see more like Easter egg, just like that video. Oh, this is amazing. Thank you for watching. If you'd like to see more videos, click the annotation on the screen. My Twitter and Instagram are in the description box down below. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. If you want more, click that subscribe button. I'm Tommy from ZD Comics, and I'll see you next time.